the big ride is back for the summer of 2015 and going to Great Heights this year to take on the most beautiful drive in the world to try and beat one of the ugliest diseases in the world. This year, the Majestic Cabot Trail, take a look at that, has been selected for this great event. Coming up in July, cyclists will take on the 300 kilometer route in one day to raise money for cancer research. How about that? It's all organized by the volunteer organization that's known as Give to Live. They are dedicated to ending illness by inspiring people to lead healthy lives. And speaking of inspiration, this is our daily dose here this morning on the Friday edition of the Morning News. We've got Chris Kidd and Ron Allen here to talk about the big ride. Two participants coming up in the trek around the Cabot Trail Relay. Guys, good morning. Thanks for having us. Yeah, welcome to the show. Very exciting stuff. When you see the video of the Cabot Trail now, it's all very majestic on video, but you guys are going to do the whole thing on bike? I try not to think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. That's, that's the plan. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But it's all going for a good cause. So whoever wants to jump in, tell me a bit about the Give to Live organization, because this is not the first year for this. Well, right it's now. a group of young people here in Halifax. It started in uh, 2007, and I was fortunate enough to be invited to go along. And we uh, were raising money for cancer, and uh, we rode our bikes to uh, Austin, Texas from Halifax the first year in a relay. And then we did it several years again uh, after that from uh, Vancouver to Austin. And, uh, and we've also got the big swim and we're doing all sorts of great stuff for, for the community. And mm. uh, it's, a, it's a group of people that really give back to the community. Yeah. I, th I think more than anything, it, it, the Gift to Live is really trying to allow people from Nova Scotia and across Canada to do something, uh, the chance to do something extraordinary. Mm -hmm. um, whether that's uh, the big swim uh, across the Thumbling Strait or whether that's this year going down the Cabot Trail. Uh, some of the numbers are staggering here. 440 riders, you've covered more than 250,000 kilometres and raised more than $1.2 million since 2007. Just unbelievable work that's been done so far. Yes. What inspired you guys to, to hop on board with this? Chris, start with you. Um, I, I had my, my own uh, midlife crisis. I, I, I lost a couple of friends and, and one of them in particular had a... Had a a saying, you know, they always asked, asked the people they were with in the morning whether they were ready to live the best day ever. Uh, and after they passed, I, I looked at myself and realised that I wasn't uh, ready to live my best day ever. Mm. So I stopped smoking, stopped uh, drinking quite as much and, and really was looking for an opportunity to get fit and give back to community. Uh, and last year I heard about the big swim and swam in, swam in the Thumberland Street last year uh, and had such a great time, uh, met some really great people uh, like Ron and others and, and you really wanted to be part of that again for a second year so this year I'm riding. Mm -hmm. Great stuff man. Ron, how about you? Well, um, I feel at uh, this stage of the game uh, life is a journey and uh, I've been on the journey for quite a while now. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I just turned 70 a couple no weeks ago. Way. A couple yeah. weeks ago? A couple weeks Happy ago. Happy birthday sir. So thank you very much yeah. and um, anyway I got uh, in with this group and thought wow what a great group of people and yeah. uh, that's one of the best things I've ever done in my life is uh, be involved with this group. Uh, example, uh, we, we pay our own way. We don't uh, use contributions for anything that we do. Yeah. We pay our own way, and uh, I think it's over 95% of what we actually raise goes to the, uh, to the program that we're, we're supporting. Unbelievable. And we have a little bit there for maybe transportation, a little bit of gas and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, so it, it's, it's just inspiring to be around a group of people that are full of energy and full of life, and they're doing something good for the community. I should mention, not only are you doing the big ride through Cabot Trail, but Ron's also going to do the big swim coming up as well. You've got both events in one year. Yes, and let me just sort of crack you a little bit, uh, Paul. Uh, uh, in the last week, I've started my training for the bicycling, and uh, my, my story now is I'm going to attempt. Oh, attempt, okay, okay. <laughs> and, 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 change slightly. And, and I don't give up easy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but I'm going to attempt to, uh, to do the, the 300 k um, on the ride and um, if I live through that then uh, the plan is to uh, try to swim Pete to Pete from New Brunswick to PEI which was done by Chris last year. Any pointers you could give him on that? Just keep swinging the arms. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Listen there's a fundraising campaign as you mentioned if people wanted to help you guys out with your fundraising how do they get involved in that? I, mean, I think the best way is just to go to the Give to Live uh, website. That's got all the details about the two charities that we, we are supporting this year through the Swim and the Ride. Mm. Um, and it's also, it has all the information on the website about how you can join up. Um, until Monday, we still have spots available, both on the Swim and the Ride. Excellent. Um, we, for the ride, it's, we have people uh, riding 300 kilometres, the full Cabot Trail. We have other people just uh, cycling one leg, 100 kilometre legs. We have some people doing it in teams. There's lots of different ways in which you can do the ride. Mm -hmm. um, and if people don't feel they, they, they can necessarily do the physical part of these events, we really need the support of people with the volunteering and just helping 
facilitate those logistics and supporting those riders to do these extraordinary things and, and get that money in. So people just go to givetolive.ca. Uh, They've got all the information they need. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Well, we're out of time, guys, but uh, very inspiring stuff. Best of luck on the ride. Thank you very much. Hope you have comfortable seats on those bikes to go 300K around Cabot Trail. Yeah. Is Kelly's Mountain covered in this? Um, it's no, not Kelly's. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, okay. Maybe I'll think about Smokies, it. Smokies, North, and Mackenzie. Okay, well, they're yeah. big enough, I guess. And uh, once you're over those, then you get to roll down French. Perfect. <laughs> There's Ron Allen and uh, Chris Kidd, participants in the Big Ride. For more information, give to live.ca. Big Ride at give to live.ca. As Lance Armstrong likes to say, it's not about the bike. Exactly. There's other things that work here. <laughs> Very inspiring stuff.